On this tutorial guys, you will learn how to paint the basic landscape with the sunrise, with a uh, beautiful tree, and many more. And guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. And guys, these are the list of colors that I use to this painting demonstration. You can also find this list of colors below to the description of this video. For the sake of this tutorial guys, I'm going to use this 10 inches by 12 inches plain white canvas. And these are the uh, colors that I use to this demonstration. First thing to do is I'm going to uh, create the uh, sky here because I'm going to create a basic landscape with the uh, one tree and the other is the uh, flowers maybe. I can make this one here. So first thing to do is I'm going to paint the sky. First is I'm going to paint the titanium white here. I'm using one inch flat brush. Just paint here the titanium white. Just there. Then the next thing to do is that I'm going to paint also the blue color, the cobalt blue, of this area here. Directly paint the cobalt blue. Just there. Just continue painting with this cobalt blue here for my sky. Then the titanium white. I'm going to paint the titanium white to this area here. Just blend this titanium white to the blue color. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. Just there. It's very nice color blending to this. Uh, first layer of my sky. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to uh, mix the color of the titanium white and the uh, small amount of yellow green and I uh, add small uh, yellow color. I'm going to paint this one here at the very bottom of this uh, sky. Just paint there. Just blend also this color going to the upper portion of my sky. Just there. I'm going to add the uh, light source of this painting to this uh, left side of my canvas. I'm going to add a light source there. Or these are the area. This is the area of my uh, sun or the light source. So just blend this color. Just add titanium white at the very bottom of this painting, and also just blend this titanium white. So that it will create a very nice and smooth color blending. Just there. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to paint directly the yellow color. Just paint the, directly here the yellow color. And also just blend this yellow color to the uh, color of, or the first layer of my color to the sky that I paint earlier. Just there, it's very nice. It's very nice here. Then the titanium white, I'm going to paint directly the titanium white here. Just blend this titanium white. Just there. That's very nice. Sky, I'm going to paint more titanium white to this area because this, this is the uh, area of my Sun. I'm going to paint there very uh, light color or the titanium white. Just paint more titanium white to this area here. It's there. I'm going to blend this color also. Now I have my first layer sky here. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to paint also the maple yellow. 
This one is the nipples yellow here. A little bit nearer. Nearer to the sun area. Let's add more nipples yellow here. Around this light color, the titanium white. For my uh, a little bit of warmer uh, clouds. Just there. Nipples yellow. Just there. It's very nice. Just blend that color there. Then the, after that, the orange color, the cadmium orange. Let's paint here. A little bit of fire. Fire from the uh, sun area. These are the warm clouds. Just there. And also just blend this color, guys. So that it will create a very nice color effect to the uh, sky. On my sky here. Just there. It's very nice. Then the yellow color. I'm going to paint also the yellow color. A little bit nearer to this uh, white color or the titan white. Just there. Just blend this yellow color to the titan white. So that it will create a very nice color effect to the sky. Paint more yellow color around this light color, the titan white. And also just blend this color. Just looking here, guys. My sky. It's looking good to my sky. Then the nipples yellow. Let's paint again the nipples yellow here. Going to paint the nipples yellow a little bit nearer. Nearer to the sun area. Just there. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the blue and also the Scarlet red, just mix these two colors to create this kind of color, the violet or the purple color. It's there. I'm going to add also this one here for my uh, shading of my clouds. And also just blend this color so that it will create a very nice uh, color effect to the uh, shading of these clouds here. Just there. Just blend also this color. Now we have a very nice color of the sky here. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. Just continue blending with this color. Just there. It's very nice and good looking. Just add more here. Yes, but I am going to blend this color so that it will uh, create a very nice. There. I have my sky here. A very nice and beautiful sky to that area there. I'm going to add also the nipples yellow. Just add more nipples yellow to this sky color. For more color effect. My sky. Let's add more nipples yellow here. Just there. It's very nice and color of the sky. To this area here. I have my beautiful sky in that area. Next thing to do is I'm going to create the mountains. Or the basic mountain there. So I'm going to uh, paint directly the... I'm going to paint directly the blue color, the cobalt blue. Just paint here, the cobalt blue. Just paint directly the cobalt blue. I'm using the half inch flat brush. I'm going to create a very uh, basic mountain here. Using this cobalt blue. 
is there going to the little bit farther mountain just there a little bit uh, blending this color my far mountain there oh, we have a very nice mountain there just blend we're going to uh, continue adding with the cobalt blue for my mountain just there now you have a very basic mountain there just there continue adding with this cobalt blue just there Going to make this a little bit bigger mountain because I'm going to make this yeah, nearer to the uh, eyesight. Let's add more cobalt blue here. Just there, it's very nice. And after that, I'm going to add also the titanium white. I'm going to blend the titanium white at the very a uh, lower portion of this mountain just there I'm going to uh, create the titanium white here uh, this portion I'm going to feed this uh, mountain so that it will create a very uh, good looking and realistic effect for the fogs fogs effect to this mountain here just there Oh, we have very nice mountain there. Just looking good for my painting here. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to uh, create also here the uh, the yellow green color at this area. I'm going to blend this yellow green color here for my subject to this area. These are my grasses, very far grasses. A little bit farther, that is just blend also this one to the titanium white that I have at the lower portion of this mountain I paint that I paint earlier. Yeah, just add more yellow green color here, and also just blend this color add more yellow green color here. For the color of the uh, the plants or the trees, the far portion of this landscape, then the titanium white again at the very lower portion of this uh, yellow green color. I'm going to blend the titanium white there. Just there. Then after that, the light green color, also the light green color here. These are the trees that are a little bit nearer. I'm going to use the light green color there. Just there. Also the one, this one, I'm going to add the light green color. A little bit nearer trees to this area. Just there. Then I'm going to paint also the uh, light green color here for the ground. I'm going to paint directly the light green color and also this one here, the uh, hooker green. I'm going to add a more. Uh, a little bit uh, dark color here but I'm going to blend this dark color to the titanium white or the light color there so that it will create a very nice color feeding effects it's there these are my grasses there the far portion of this uh, landscape just there Add more hawker green here. This, these are the trees or the color of the trees, a little bit nearer to this area here, this subject. 
going to paint directly the hawker green. Just observe for my uh, brush strokes. Just there. Uh, we have we have a very nice uh, trees there. For the basic trees. Just there. Just continue adding this hawker green. Just there. It's very nice now. Just observe my brush strokes. Now. now let's continue here. The next thing to do is I'm going to create a yes, tree on that area there, in this area here. And I'm I'm going to use this number four uh, flat brush. Going to add a tree to this area. Just, just there. I'm going to uh, paint directly the Mars black color for the base color of this tree. It's there. Then I'm going to uh, use my round brush again. The number four uh, round brush. I'm going to use this one for more uh, detail for this trunk. Using this Mars black color there, I'm going to uh, create the, uh, a tree to this area here. Just there. Then I'm going to create the uh, the branches and the twigs to this tree, going to the upper portion there. Just there. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to I'm going to uh, create the uh, the uh, leaves or the base color of the leaves using this hawker green here. I'm going to create the uh, leaves here for using this hawker green. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. These are my uh, basic tree. Then the base color of my leaves, I'm going to add also here. Just there. Going to the upper portion. Just there. Just paint directly the hawker green. Also just observe my brush strokes. Just there. Then I'm going to uh, uh, add detailed. I'm going to detail this trunk. Mars black color, I'm going to add because it the Mars black color there. I'm using the number for a uh, round brush for the detail of this trunk under the branches. Just there. Add more branches to this tree and the twigs. Going to add also the twigs there. Just there. Give more detail going down there. Just looking good. Now I'm going to change my brush into a 12 flat brush, number 12. I'm going to paint here the hooker green at the very lower portion of this area. The hooker green there. Just paint directly the hooker green. Just there. Just continue adding with this hooker green. Going to this to the left portion of my canvas. Just there. It's looking good for now. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the. Uh, going to give detail this one. So I'm going to mix the color of the orange and the marsh black color. Again, I mix these two colors to create this kind of color here. I'm going to paint this one here for the darker brown or just paint directly the orange color. But I'm going to blend this orange color to the marsh black color so that it will uh, create another color effects to this trunk. It's there. 
Spain directly the orange color there. Going to the upper portion of this tree. Just there. And then the uh, Rushina color. I'm going to paint also the Rushina color here. For this uh, highlight of this tree. I'm going to paint directly the Rushina color. Just there. Oh, we have a very nice trunk now. The Rushina color there. Also just observe my brass rocks. Then after that I'm going to uh, add also the blue color, the cobalt blue at the very back portion of this tree. For a little bit of uh, highlight to this trunk here. And the orange color, I'm going to add the orange color at the upper portion of this trunk. For a little a highlight there. The upper portion of this trunk here. Just there. The orange color, I'm going to add the orange color there. Just there. And also the uh, Rushina. I'm going to add Rushina here. A little bit. Because this area is affected by the lights. That's why I'm going to add more uh, light color to this area. Just there. And the nipples yellow also. I'm going to add the nipples yellow for more highlight color effect to this trunk. Just there. And we have very nice uh, color of this trunk here. Just there. Now I have my trunk on that area there. The next thing to do is I'm going to I'm going to add detail for that the leaves of this tree. I'm going to add a detail there. So I'm going to use this the light green color for the leaves of this tree. Light green color there. How about I'm going to add a uh, going to add the orange color at the upper portion of this tree. The orange color there for the uh, color effect of this uh, leaves this tree. Just there, the orange color or the cobalt or the uh, cadmium, the cadmium orange. Just there, I'm using number twelve flat brush. And the scarlet red at the back portion. The back portion of this tree, I'm going to paint the scarlet red. For the dark leaves, to this tree. Scarlet red there. Let's paint the scarlet red. Just there, it's a very good looking tree. Then the yellow color, I'm going to add the yellow color for the highlight. Yellow color for the highlight of this tree. On this uh, left side of my tree, I'm going to add the highlight color using this uh, cadmium yellow. Just there, the cadmium yellow. For the highlight color effects to this tree. Just there. Also this one. At this area. I'm going to add the uh, yellow color there. Just adding this yellow color. A little bit highlight effect to this area here. Just there. Then the next is the hooker green at the at lower portion. Let's add the hooker green here at the lower portion of this tree. Just there. So this one, the hooker green. Paint the hooker green here. Just there. Let's continue adding this hooker green there now. After that, the uh, scarlet red also. I'm going to add the scarlet red.
just there, it's scarlet red. I'm using number 12 flat brush, just there, and the orange color. Going to add the orange color there to create a very nice color of this tree. Just the orange or the cadmium orange there, just there. And the uh, light green color, I'm going to add also the light green color. I have a very nice color of the tree here. Let's add more uh, light green color there for the leaves or the green leaves to this tree here. Just continue here. It's a very nice colorful tree. The light green color, just continue adding the light green color here. Uh, this portion uh, going to going down there the light green color just observe my brass rocks guys just there then the Mars black color I'm going to add more uh, uh, just gives detail for these branches here for this tree so that it will uh, create a very nice uh, tree here just there, also this one. Using this Mars black color, going to add the branches and the twigs also to give more uh, small detail here for this tree. Just there. And also this one here. I'm going to create the bronze on the twigs. Just create more here. Going to the upper portion there. Also this one here. Just there. The, the trunk. I'm going to create the detail. This trunk. Small detail here for this trunk here. Then the orange color. I'm going to. Uh, give more uh, color here. The orange color there. Then the Rushina color. I'm going to add also the Rushina color for the color of this trunk. Just there. Now we have a very nice color of this trunk and also this one for the branch color. The Rushina. Just there. In the cobalt blue, I'm going to add also the cobalt blue. A little bit back portion of this tr trunk. Cobalt blue here. Just there. Add more cobalt blue here. Now we have a very nice colorful tree to this area. A very nice tree there. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to uh, create the fins. I'm going to create the fins here. I'm going to mix the color of this cobalt blue and the Mars black color. Just mix these two colors, the cobalt blue and the Mars black color, and just add titanium white. I'm going to add a small titanium white there. This is only the base color of co color for my fins here. I'm going to add the fins. Um, the fins that are made of wood or just paint directly the mars black color here for my fins later I'm going to add a yeah, detail for these fins here mars black color there just paint directly the mars black color I'm going to paint directly here the mars black color For my fins, that is here, just continue adding this Mars black color, this one here, later I'm going to add a detail for these fins, this, uh, this fins is made up of wood, that's 
that's there oh yeah I have my base color of my fins to this area here just there just continue adding with this a color the much black color for the fins then the uh, round brush number four round brush I'm going to add also here to be for another wood that uh, wood that are uh, connected connected to this here is only the base color here just there I have my fins to that area there the base color fins then after that I'm going to paint the hooker green at the very lower portion here just paint the hooker green here it's there. I'm going to paint there the hooker green. Go in there. Now let's continue here. I'm going to uh, add detail for this area uh, finch. So I'm going to mix the color of the uh, cobalt blue and also the titanium white. Let's mix these two colors. I'm going to add this one here. First, I'm going to add color for this here, this uh, horizontal wood. Just there. I'm going to add first here the color of this wood. Just there. And this one at the very uh, lower uh, horizontal wood here. I'm I'm going to add here first color because this wood or the horizontal wood the horizontal wood is inside to these fins or inside to this here that's why I'm going to uh, give a color to this here then after that I'm going to add more detail for this wood or the vertical wood for the fins just there Just continue here. That's there. Then the uh, hooker green, or no, the uh, nipples yellow. I'm going to add also the nipples yellow. Just there. Then the marsh black color. I'm going to add also the marsh black color. Just, just paint here the marsh black color so that I'm going to erase this one here. The uh, color that are not included to this here that's there using the marsh black color I'm going to erase the uh, existing colors so that wood there the wood inside wood just there let's continue adding this marsh black color just there now I have my uh, inner uh, wood now so the next thing to do is I'm going to I'm going to mix the color of the orange and also the marsh black color just mix these two colors going to paint this one here at the uh, lower portion of this horizontal wood the uh, dark orange color or the brown color just there then I'm going to blend this here or the Mars black color to create the edge color here or the edge of this uh, wood or the corner just there just continue adding this marsh black color just there I have very nice wood there then after that I'm going to 
uh, mix the color of this here, the orange, the orange and also the Mars black color, just small amount of Mars black to the orange color to create this brown color. I'm going to paint this one here for the color of my fins. Just there. Orange and also the Mars black color, just small amount of Mars black there. Uh, color of my wood or the fins. Just creating these fins here. Just there. Also this one. Orange color. Just there. Just continue here. Just looking good for my fins here. Then the orange color, I'm going to add also the orange color. For more color effect to this wood. Just there. Orange color there. Let's paint directly the orange color for the color of these fins here. Let's paint here the fins. Just there. It's very nice and good looking fins now. Just there. And after that the nipples yellow. I'm going to add also the nipples yellow. For the highlight of these uh, fins at this corner, I'm going to add the highlight effects there using this uh, nipples yellow. This one here, I'm going to add the highlight effect there. Uh, we have a very nice color of these fins. This one also here for the highlight effects. This area is affected by the this area is affected by the highlights coming from this the sun. That's why I'm going to add more highlight color to the left side of these fins. Just there. Just looking good now for my fins here. Just there. Now for the Rushina color. I'm going to add also the Rushina color here. For more color effect to this wood. The Rushina color. Just there. Rushina color. Just looking good for my uh, fins here. Rushina color again. Just add more Rushina color here. For the color of this uh, wood or the fins. The wood. The fins that are made up of wood. Just there. Uh, it's very nice fins here, or the fins color. Just there. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the. I'm going to mix the color of the rouge, uh, the titanium white and cobalt blue. Just mix these two color to create the sky blue color. Just there. I'm going to mix this one here. I'm going to add this one. The area that are not affected by the. Uh, lights coming from the sun so i'm going to add this one here yeah. sky blue color highlight coming from the other source or the uh 
lights coming from the clouds that are reflected to that back portion of the uh, wood just there uh, now you have a very nice color of this wood here just continue adding with the uh, the sky blue color for a more highlight effect to this wood that's there just there and add more sky blue color or just mix sky blue color the blue and the titanium white create this kind of color here the sky blue color I'm going to paint here just for more color of this wood for a color effect of this wood here just observe my brush strokes guys one there is very nice now that one there you have very nice fins color here or the old fins it's there now we have a very nice nice fins to that area there then the next thing to do is I'm going to use my 12 flat brush number 12 flat brush just paint here for the uh, hooker green for the lower portion of these fins I'm going to add the plants to this area I'm going to paint directly the uh, hooker green to this area here for the base color of my plants to this area it's there and also this one I'm going to add small hooker green here I'm going to add the plants to this area here going there the upper portion just there then the yellow green color I'm going to add also the yellow green color just there yellow green color and just blend this yellow green color then the light green color I'm going to add also the light green color here just there it's very nice just blend this color the yellow green color also here for more grasses color just looking good there then the Yorushina color at uh, the lower portion to add the Rushina color here Rushina color the lower portion this here for the soil and the Mars black color okay, to add also the Mars black color there for the shading of these plants going to the uh, there, the Mars black color. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. Just there. It's very nice now. Then the uh, orange color, I'm going to add also the orange color. Just there. The orange color and also more Rushina color. The uh, color of the soil there. Just there. Now we have very nice color there. In the light green color, I'm going to add also the light green color here. Just blend this light green color to the uh, Rushina. And also the uh, light, just paint light green color here. Just there. Now we have a very nice color of the grasses there. Then the yellow color, I'm going to add also the yellow color. Just paint here the yellow color. For the color of my grasses to the ground. Just there. Just looking good in that area there. Then after that, the, uh, I'm going to add this one here. Another color effects there. The, uh, I'm going to mix the color of light green and also the titanium white to create more light color. I'm going to paint this one here for the uh, the grasses to this area here and plants that area there. Then the uh, nipples yellow. I'm going to add the nipples yellow here. Nipples yellow. 
is there for my soil. Then the uh, hoker green, I'm going to add also the hoker green to this area here. Hoker green for the uh, another color of the uh, grass is there. Just there. The hoker green. Let's continue adding the hoker green here. Just there. Just continue there, the hooker green, for uh, more grasses effect, this area here. Just there. Now I have a very nice color of my grasses to that area there. Just there. Then the next thing to do is I'm going to uh, add, I'm going to mix the color of the uh, blue and also the red color to create this purple color this one I'm going to add this one here that one there for the flowers effect to this area here that one there then the yellow color I'm going to add also the yellow color but first I'm going to clean my brush for more flower effect to this area here Just observe my brush strokes, guys. Now let's continue here. I'm going to add more uh, detail to this area first. I'm going to add the flowers there. So I'm going to mix the uh, or just I'm going to mix the color of the yellow and the titanium white. Just mix these two colors to create the lighter yellow. Just there. I'm going to add this one here for the flowers. flowers effect to this area here and after that I'm going to mix the color of the scarlet red and also the nipples yellow I'm going to mix these two colors add more nipples yellow this to this this color and I'm going to paint this one here for the flowers effect it's there it's very nice color of the flowers here just there and after that I'm going to add also the uh, nipples yellow I'm going to add this one the nipples yellow for the highlight effect here the highlight of these flowers just there then also the I'm going to add also the uh, Scarlet red. I'm going to add the scarlet red here. Just there. Then the uh, I'm going to mix the color of the uh, scarlet red, the scarlet red and the uh, titanium white. I'm going to mix these two colors to create the pink color. Pink. It should be more titanium white. Just there. I'm going to add this one here. The one there. Now we have very nice colorful flowers there. And after that I'm going to add also the uh, the blue color. Already cobalt blue here. It's there, the cobalt blue. Just there. Then I'm going to mix the color of the uh, cobalt blue and also the scarlet red. I'm going to mix these two color. It should be more cobalt blue. Just there to create this kind of color. And add titanium white. Just there. I'm going to add as well this one here. That one there. Then the yellow color, I'm going to add also the yellow color here. For more color effect to these flowers. Just there. It's very nice and good looking flowers there. Then the scarlet red, I'm going to paint directly the scarlet red here. Just 
just there. It's pretty nice now. Now I have my very uh, good looking uh, flowers there. I'm going to add also the titanium white here for more flowers effect here. I can color the flowers. Let's paint directly the titanium white. It's there. Now I have my flowers in that area, so I'm going to continue this one here. I'm going to uh, paint also the Rushina color. Let's paint the Rushina color here for my soil. This area. Let's paint directly the Rushina color. It's there. Then the uh, yellow green color. I'm going to add also the yellow green color for my ground on this area here. Just blend this yellow green color. Just there. It's very nice now. Just there. Then the nipple yellow. I'm going to add also the nipple yellow here. Going there. Let's add the nipple yellow. I just paint the directly the nipple yellow. Just there. It's very nice and good looking to this area here. I have a very nice view. Then the Rushina color. I'm going to add also the Rushina color here. Just there. Then after that, the uh, scarlet red. I'm going to mix the color with scarlet red and also the Rushina color. To create this kind of color. Just there. I'm going to add also this one here. For another color of this area. Just there. Then I'm going to mix the color of the uh, scarlet red and also the marsh black color. Scarlet red and the marsh black color to create this dark color. I'm going to add this one here. For the shading of this here. To minimize also the light color here. Uh, that's why I'm going to paint directly the dark color of the I mixed earlier. The marsh black and also the scarlet red. Just there is very nice and good looking to this area here. Just there. And after that, I'm going to add the plants on that area. Using the uh, hooker green here, I'm going to add also this one here for the plants. Just there. Hooker green also. I'm going to minimize this lighter color here. Just blend this for hooker green. Just there. Then after that, I'm going to uh, paint the light green color here. For the uh, leaves here. Of this plants to this area just there it's very nice and good looking plants to this area just there I'm going to paint just observe my brush strokes guys for the uh, plants to this area here now you have a very nice color of the uh, grass there I'm going to uh, use the number 4 round brush for the grasses here Number four round brush here. Or I'm going to uh, get my pointed brush, number zero brush. I'm going to use this one here for my grasses. One there. Then the hooker green. I'm going to add also here the hooker green for the, uh, the shading of the grasses here. Hooker green. One there. Then I'm going to mix the color, the green color, the light green and also the blue color. I'm going to mix these two colors to create this kind of colors or color. Paint here for the leaves.
another uh, types of leaves here or the plants going to add also this one here that one there that one there just continue adding with the plants or the leaves of these plants here giving a more detail there light green color let's add more light green color here that one there then I'm going to add more detail to that area there using this number with flat brush I'm going to add also the yellow green color here for the lighter uh, color of the plants or the highlight of these leaves here yellow green color just there yellow green color the highlight of these leaves there just looking good then the uh, cobalt blue need to add also the cobalt blue for the flowers effect of this area here cobalt blue here just there so this one I'm going to add the flowers here just there I'm going to mix the color of the cobalt blue and also the titanium white to create the sky blue color titanium white and the uh, cobalt blue this one there I'm going to add also this one here for the highlight of these flowers there now we have a very nice colorful uh, flowers here one there that one there orange or the cadmium orange for more flower effects here for more flowers effect of this area one there now we have very nice color of my flowers here one there in the yellow color I'm going to add also the yellow color for the uh, little bit highlight of these flowers here one there yellow color here uh, very nice color there then the nipples yellow I'm going to add also the nipples yellow here for the flower effects or another color of the flowers there the nipples yellow let's continue adding this one here the nipples yellow now we have a very nice colorful painting here on there then the uh, light green color I'm going to add also the light green color that one there I'm going to mix the color of the uh, light and uh, light green and the marsh black color the light green in the marsh black color I'm going to mix these two colors I'm going to add this one here for the uh, darker grasses under these plants I'm going to mix the color of light green and also the marsh black that one there now we have very nice view to this area here then the yellow green color I'm going to add also this one here yellow green color there for small uh, grasses to the ground yellow green color there this one also here there it's very nice now to my area there then the yellow color I'm going to add also the yellow color That one there then the uh, light green color also I'm going to add also this one here the light green color for the uh, 
color of the uh, grass is there in this area. Now we have a very nice and a beautiful painting here. The, then I'm going to mix the color of the nipple yellow and the titanium white. Just mix these two colors the nipple yellow and the titanium white. I'm going to paint this one here. Selecting the area there. That one there. That one. The nipple yellow. I'm going to add also the nipple yellow. Then the orange color. I'm going to add also the orange color here. Cadmium orange. I'm going to add this one here. Now we have very nice color of that area there. Then the scarlet red and the marsh black color. Just mix these two color again to minimize more color effect. This one here or the highlight effect to this soil. That one there. Now we have very nice color there. Then the rushina. I'm going to mix the rushina. I'm going to mix the rushina and the titanium white. To create the lighter uh, yellow, just there. I'm going to add this one here for more highlight effect. What I'm doing. I'm going to add more titanium white to create more lighter rushina, lighter yellow. Let's paint here. Just there. It's very good looking here. And now for the uh, final retouch for this uh, tree, I'm going to paint also the orange color of this area, the upper portion of this tree. The orange color there. Then the yellow green color, I'm going to add also the yellow green color here. A little bit uh, younger uh, leaves to this tree. Just there. Add more yellow green color. For this area, just there, it's a very nice, good looking tree. Then the uh, yellow color, I'm going to add also the yellow color at this area, at this side. Just there, it's very good looking here, a look, good looking tree. Just there, the yellow green color, I'm going to continue adding this yellow green color for the color of the leaves here on this tree. For the younger leaves, just there. It's very good looking part of this tree. The younger leaves here. I'm going to add one there. Also this one. Now we have a very nice color of my tree. Then the yellow color. I'm going to add also the yellow color here. Just add small yellow color. Just there. Also this one, the yellow color. Just there. Go into the upper portion. There is very nice now. You know guys, we're done with this painting demonstration. We have a very nice view here and a colorful painting. I hope this demonstration is helpful for you. And guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. You can also leave comments and hit like button below this video. And guys, thanks for watching. See you for my next painting demonstration. Peace.